We are here at one of the biggest events at the Berlin Arle 2023. Fatih Akin, Wim Wenders, Lewis Hoffman are just some of the names that we are about to encounter and we are about to see. So make sure you're here to be able to see these exciting interviews. If there was a young person that was in your position and that wanted to be in your position, what advice would you give them? Well, you got to believe in yourself and that you can do something that nobody else can do and you have to find out what that is. And once you find it out, you have to fight for it and stick to it and don't listen too much to what everybody else is. You also have to believe that things happen for a purpose and that you're given a gift and that you have to be thankful for it and that you have to be thankful for a lot of things because art is not coming out of one person man or woman art is coming out of a big heart and an openness for the world hello Fatiyakin are you okay I'm okay for someone that wants to be in your position like a young person what advice would you give them oh, it's very difficult to say because I'm a permanent student you know every day I learn it's like whatever I achieve I, I doubt it the next day and I try to make it better you know so this is the way how I see things you know this is like it's not really something that I could teach I wish there would be something I could teach and I would do it but all I know is that I don't know if there was a child right here who is essentially 14 to 11 years old what would you say to him to be able to get into the position that you're in now I would say ignore the naysayers believe in yourself trust in yourself be confident and um, just keep going what would you say has been the most difficult decision you've had to make? The most difficult decision in my life? Well, it was a long time ago when I decided to not stay in America but come back to Germany because I realized I was not going to be an American. I was a German in my heart and had to stand to it. It was difficult because I had other dreams. But then I was relieved because I stuck to my guns and my guns were the guns of a German romantic, a hopeless German romantic. Emerson, you're doing a good job. What's been the easiest and hardest things in your career that you've had to overcome? I think the easiest thing for me was to always find joy in what I do. I think that is where I take my energy from and that's um, why I'm so ambitious and why I love it so much. It's, it's, it's very easy for me to be happy with what I'm doing, I think, when I'm doing it. And the hardest thing was probably working on my English accent for the past six years. But it's, it's, it's getting there now, but that's been really hard. What's been your favourite film to make and why? <laughs> <laughs> the very first. And ever since, I try to make it feel like it was the first. For someone that may be younger and maybe as ambitious as you and wishes to be able to accomplish something in life, what adv advice would you give them to be able to do such things? I think it's extremely important to have discipline, of course ambition, um, but like I said before, always try to find the joy in it because that is where most of the power comes from because when you love what you do, and you fight for it because you love it, then your power is going to be endless. What has been the easiest and hardest thing that you've had to encounter to be able to get into this position right now? Well, first of all, I think sometimes it's difficult to hear your own voice because you hear so many noise, you know, you hear so much what other people say, like how to do it and what's the right way and what's the wrong way. And and I listen to everybody and I listen to nobody at the same time. I try to listen to my own voice, but sometimes it's very hard to, to, to hear that voice, you know. That's, that's, the, that's, that's the one thing, you know. And then it's like industry is changing, you know, always, you know, like every day is dif different. And when the industry change, you know, you, I, I don't mean that you have to be like, you have to be like, um, go with the wind, but you have to be flexible if you wanna, if you wanna reach audience, you know, because audience change, you know. And I think that's difficult, you know, to be update with what's going on in the world of cinema today.
and away. Fatih Akin, it's been a pleasure. I hope you have a brilliant evening and thank you for taking this interview. Thank you so much. Thank, thank you very much. We've just had some amazing interviews with some amazing people and the party has only just started at the Berlinale 2023. So make sure you're here because we have more for you or else you will miss out. See you soon.